What's going on YouTube? This is Dax and your Weaver Family Farm. So, it has been quite a while and I'm not sure exactly the date. And the, most of the tree cuttings I did did not make it. Um, I'm pretty excited because I just came in here and these lights had actually been on for a few days. I hadn't been in here. I pulled one of these cuttings out and I was like, oh my gosh, there's a lot of pressure. I'm so excited. Look at those roots. This is a uh, Euonymus, and I can't remember which one it is, but I'm really proud. This is probably the best success I've had, once again, using grow lights and a heat mat in this container. Really, really, really good roots. Um, you can see I checked this one. It failed. We're going to go through and go ahead and check the other ones. Might as well. This one looks like it died. There's some pressure on this one. This bad boy's got some roots. So that's two. There's a little bit of pressure here. We got roots here. That's so exciting. That one looks like it rotted, unfortunately. But we got roots back here. Oh yeah, nice. Died off. So that one probably isn't gonna do anything. I feel something back here. I'm trying to be so careful not to rip these roots. Little roots there. And I did honestly forget about these, which I know you're supposed to do. And there's not really any moisture in the soil, so I'm hoping these things are gonna be okay. Um, that one didn't do nothing something back here there's quite a, there's some pressure here there's some nice roots and there's gonna be a little bit of roots there right off the soil really nice so for the first time doing this inside this is the best success I've had here especially at these Euonymus I got one two three four five six or so did and then about six so there's about a 50 percent success rate and I do know at the beginning which some of these look like they did rot about three or so of them, four of them. And I did have this way too moist to begin with. Um, so, you know, it's kind of one of them things, lesson learned on that. Um, but I'm really excited with these ones I do have. Now this one's brown on the bottom. It's almost like it turned to hardwood or something, or it's you know, rotted or something. I'm not totally sure. But uh, I'm gonna get one more picture of this one with the huge roots I'm really proud of over here in front of the, this light instead of the grow lights. Really, really nice. These roots are about as long as this cutting is, so pretty excited. So I'll go and I'm gonna get these um, little dudes potted up in something upstairs so we can get some uh, nice natural sunlight and I can keep a better eye on them. But uh, that's an update video for rooting some cuttings in the basement um, inside and it is uh, the end of November and I started these, I wanna say like the beginning of October, but I can't remember, it's been quite a while. But thanks for watching, see you later, bye-bye.